hello, hello, hello. Oh, today is story time with Kelsey, and we have Miss Charlie Brown. So Kelsey's going to read her story. I am reading the King's Birthday. Here's a picture of it. See, I'm going to show you. Six months passed until King Alfred saw his knight. This time he did not need their help, but he asked them to come to his birthday <coughs> party. The king has had asked five hundred uh -uh, five hundred people Here, to join please. him. He had made plants plans for a large as well as jousting magic and dancing, everyone was very excited. The pulses was filled with five thousand candles. Good. Gold cloth was draped on the walls. Mm -hmm. King Alfred had planted a treat for everyone just as the jousting was about to begin a thousands white dovins were to be released into the sky. Released. It, that's what I said, released. Okay. The sky abrove the places. King Alfred asked King Henry, <laughs> the king of another kingdom, uh -huh. to attend the birthday party. The twelve knights were coming to King Henry's <coughs> knights were going to challenge no. King Alfred's knights and Look. jousting the <coughs> winners would get hundred gold <coughs> coins each on the day of the party, the king met some of Goodbye. his knights. This is going to be the best party ever, said the excited king. I am eager to see each of you. Just, I think King Henry and his knights will be amazed by your skill. Winning will be our birthday gift. To be to you, sir, said Sir Pete. We are the most feared knights of all. He said, Sir Tom, mm -hmm. we will crush them, we make them cry. Mm, nope. Uh -huh. You ain't get more. We will make them cry. Uh -huh. no. Sir Gus looked on as his fellow knights reduced on of their skill. He did not join them in he was very nervous. He was hopping that little that start itching and fall off his horse. Mm -hmm. I gotta show you the picture. It's on the side because it's not the whole page. Oh, okay. <laughs> See all the knights on the stairs are all different kinds of people on there. Mm -hmm. Ow! She's just sit down. Oh. I know you will win, 
said the king, and that will make a fine birthday present. I thank you in advance. The knights began to fill our Sir Gus called the king. Your majesty, said Sir Gus, do you like my birthday cake? asked the king. Yes, sir. Do you see how the maker made the teeny king out of it? That looks just like me. Yes, sir. It is a wonderful birthday present, but the best present of all will be seeing you defeat Sir Ivan. Defeat. That's what I said. I said defeat. Oh, defeat. okay. The Black Knight in the Jousting, Sir Livin asked Sir Gus nervously. Yes, said the king. He has made quite a fearsome name for himself. But I trust you will be beat him. Sir Gus was too scared to speak. Well then, said the king, off you go, and happy birthday to me. The end. Cool. That was the end of the king's birthday. Cool. So you have to write a report on that? Yes. And I, I think... Ask your questions? I think I do, honey. I'm talking about, like, a t test for school or something. No, I don't have to write, write questions. Questions. Okay. And so <clears throat> I have to read this uh, another. So I have to read this two more times uh, t uh, tomorrow. Oh, okay. Because I have to do it three times. Is that an AR or whatever you call it? No, it's not an AR because I have to practice it because I, we are going to take a test on that. Okay, that's what I was wondering. Out at school. Yeah, that's what I was wondering. I don't wondering. have any things to do on it. Okay, she needs a sign back. Okay, well, tell everybody. Thank them for coming. Thank you for coming. Okay, I'll see you next Tuesday. I'll see you next Tuesday. Be there. Be there or be square. Peace out. Love you. Bye. Bye. The King's birthday.